South Korea is mourning the death of a long-respected opposition lawmaker who took his own life on Monday. There were allegations No Hae Chan had accepted illegal funding. In an apparent suicide note, No wrote that he did accept money, less than 50,000 US dollars, but it had nothing to do with any illicit political favors. For more on the suicide that truly shocked an entire nation, Kim Min Ji reports. Noe Chan, a three-term lawmaker with the minor opposition Justice Party, who was marred in a bribery scandal, jumped to his death on Monday. His body was found near an apartment building where his mother and brother live at around 9.40 in the morning. Police later found his jacket in a stairwell and inside were his wallet and three suicide notes. Noe's death has sent a shock through Korean politics, especially given his clean image. He was an icon of the labor movement and of progressive politics and was also popular for his pithy remarks. His image was tainted, however, by allegations that he received illegal political funds worth over 44,000 U.S. dollars from a group led by a blogger known as Drew King. The lawmaker had denied the allegations and said he would respond to questioning sincerely if summoned. Two of the suicide notes were to his family and have not been released. In the note for his party, though, he said he had accepted funds worth some $35,000 in total on two occasions in 2016, but claimed there were no special favors or any promises in return. A party spokesperson read out the note in which No said he had been foolish for not going through the official procedures for receiving political contributions. Who can I blame? It was a foolish decision and a shameful error in judgment. I must take responsibility for it. Although my time ends here, I hope the party will go on with confidence. I apologize to the Korean people. It's all my fault, so please allow me to accept this punishment and please continue to support the Justice Party. The bribery allegations were brought to light amid an investigation into the blogger Drew King, who is on trial for allegedly using hacking software to manipulate online comments on political news articles, to sway public opinion and win personal favors. It was found that money had been transferred to no from a counseling to the blogger. The case is currently being looked at by a special prosecutor team following a police investigation. The Justice Party said it regrets that the probe has led to such devastating consequences when its original point was not Noe's finances but the manipulation scheme. The independent counsel leading the probe, Haik Bum, expressed sorrow in a televised briefing and sent words of condolences to the lawmaker and his family. Noe's funeral will take place on Friday. Kim Min-ji, Arirang News.